So right now, Laura's going to take Murphy, who is our probably 25-pound overweight golden retriever who is staying with us at Indigo Ranch, over to the scale to weigh him. This is the first thing we do to establish how overweight the dog actually is. Come on, Murphy, over here, buddy. Wait, wait, don't get on yet. Okay, we're going to turn on the scale. Murphy's going to get up on the scale, haha. -ha. This is a two-person job. <laughs> Come on, Murphy. Come here, buddy. Move up on the scale. Okay, sit. Sit, Murphy, sit. Good sit, buddy. Good sit. Ah, ah. See where you are. Oh, hold still. Okay, let's one more second. I think I almost had it. Hold on, hold on. Good boy. Okay, got it. Okay, Murphy weighs in at 97.8 pounds, and that is a golden retriever. So I'm going to say he should probably be about mm, 75 pounds, so he's close to 22 pounds overweight. Okay, point this way, Alexis. <laughs> and this was Laura. Laura's our dead mother. We're going to talk to Laura a little later on. But the first thing we do when we start this program is we weigh these dogs in, figure out how far approximately how much overweight they are, and then we send their owner to the vet to do a health check. So we, just like a human, we want to make sure that the dogs are healthy enough for weight loss. And uh, once the vet has given us the, go the green light and shown us or given us, provided for us the records, the vet records, we have our vet review those and we formulate a plan, a weight loss plan based on those records and the age and the size and the bone size of the dog. So the big thing is meal plans. And really when it comes to weight loss in a dog, it's just like a human, you can exercise till the end of time, but if you keep eating Ben and Jerry's, you're gonna keep being overweight. <laughs> so, so, and unfortunately a lot of these owners are feeding their dogs Ben and Jerry's, and this is how they get overweight. In Murphy's case, we hear that he steals eggs from the chicken coop and I told the owner I didn't think that was a big deal because eggs are actually a good, a healthy form of lean protein, but she told me he steals about a dozen at a time. <laughs> so Murphy's a little excessive on the egg stealing, and he might be eating a lot of other things she's not mentioning. But anyway, uh, so once we set up our meal plan, this is what we do. We cut them down to measured meals, which we're going to show you in a minute. And every day, twice a day, they eat a measured meal. We'll show you shortly exactly why it doesn't work to do it any other way.